on this episode of World Domination Wrestling Alliance. Eight teams will battle in a tournament to determine the new WDWA Tag Team Champions. The Drexler Brothers, the Faculty, the Father Figures, Dance Sensation, Nanny, Dead Squad, the Lucha Amigos, Big Money Inc. And the Regulators. All battle for a chance of gold. This episode of World Domination Wrestling Alliance starts right now. Welcome to a new edition of World Domination Wrestling Alliance Pro Wrestling. On this episode, we have a special tournament to determine the new tag team champions. And we were able to talk to one of the teams that has been given a lot to talk about lately, the Dance Sensation. Let's hear what they had to say. Yeah, you already know who it is. The SoundCloud Sensation, Anton, Nathan, and today I'm teamed up with Dance, Dance, Lucha, Libre. And we're in this tag team tournament and we're going up against the father figures. Well, let me tell you something. Dance, Dance's dad left him as a child. So we're gonna show no remorse. You already know. Dance Sensation will be in action later on this episode, but first let's go to our opening contest a match on the tag team tournament. The Drexler brothers will be taking on the faculty and that match starts right now. Welcome to another edition of World Domination Wrestling Alliance right here on TV10. We got the faculty making their way to the ring now. Our faculty. Coach Mike Osborne with that whistle again, Travis. That's right. And Looks like Professor Jacob Edwin. He has the book of knowledge. And they will be going against the Drexler brothers coming off their big win from Berkeley Mania against Mike Strong and Eric C. Jones. It's the only kind of action that you can find like that is right here in the World Domination Wrestling Alliance. As we await the Drexler brothers. They had their debut tag team match uh, the last time we saw them on WDWA TV. They had a very impressive showing. That's right. They put Big Mike Strong and Eric C. Jones through a table. But tonight against the faculty, this is when we're really going to see if they got what it takes. guys look big and mean, Travis. Yes, they do. Hiding their faces in the masks. There's a little bit of mystique there. It's either that or they're two ugly mofos. Yeah, yeah. You said it, Gavin. Yeah. 
Billy Bowers in the ring, your official referee for this contest. There's a big tournament that is happening right here in the WDWA to crown the tag team champions. Should be an excellent contest between these two teams. These two teams, uh, we know that the faculty, they've been around. They've been around a long time. Seasoned tag team, the Drexler brothers, trying to make their name here. You have two family units here, you know, and when you have two uh, people on the same tag team that are family, they work real well to each other. So, honestly, this match can go either way, Travis. That's right, Jacob Edwin and Michael Osborne, real life uncle and nephew. Billy Bowers trying to get this match into the ring now. Look at that, the crowd is chanting, get in the ring. They want to see some action tonight. And that they will get, they will get all the action. Coming to you, coming to you from the Custom Creations, Martinsburg, West Virginia. That's right, 605 B Winchester Avenue. Yeah, the you, fans are ready to start this night, Travis. They, this place is packed. I mean, they left uh, Berkeley Mania they, excited to see what happens next, and we are here in the opening contest. There was a lot of different stories that end at Berkeley Mania with a one, two, three. We got new stories starting here tonight, Travis. That's right. Everybody wants that gold. And when there's uh, a chance for tag team gold, a chance for TV gold. Hear that? That's all for you, Osborne. They love you. Oh, come on, Jacob Edwin. Pearl Harbor. Billy Bowers trying to keep control of this match. Oh, it's going to be hard to keep control of this. Now, a little bit of tag team action from the faculty. Jacob Edwin, he's uh, he's trying to keep keep the tight end on, on their terms with the big chop and then a right fist. You know, Jacob Edwin is an actual professor. Like this guy is brilliant. You know, truly, he knows how to keep that ring cut off. He knows how to break down the opponent's body. Oh, look, look at, at that. the strength of Damian Drexler. Double oh. insecurity. That was a nice move. Very nice, Michael Osborne, he's got some kicks of his own. He's kicking him in the back of the head there. Yeah, Michael, Michael Osborne bringing the heat to Damian Drexler. You gotta respect that referee. The referee's trying to keep this match contained here. Oh, back elbow. Michael Osborne said, not today. I don't know too much about these Drexler brothers, but it looks like uh, Osborne and, and uh, Jacobs both have a lot more experience than these guys. For sure, they're firing off on all cylinders right now. Very good tag team, and they are proving it tonight. Do you think the faculty can make it all the way to the end, win the tag titles? I definitely think they have the talent for it. For sure. And you know, one thing about these Drexler brothers, you know, they're very unorthodox, so. You never know what's going to happen with these guys. They, they can come out of left field, right field. You see that slap to the face right there, Travis? Now what's, what's the Drexel brother have in store? Nope. Pick right to the face from Edwin. There you go. Huge forearm by Jacob. Now both Jacob Edwin and Michael Osborne in the ring now. Double atomic drop. Ooh. Man, they are just focusing on that spine of Damian Drexler. Yes, they are. Michael Osborne going for the cover, too. The Drexler brothers are going to have to reconnect here. They're going to have to figure out what they got to do. It's not looking good for them. Michael Osborne taking advantage of that mask.
Damien is getting his arm worked on right now. The big tag to Jacob Edwin. Oh. Come on, Bill, you gotta take control of this. With the forearms to the face now. Big old flippers to the left side of Damien's face. There you go, Jake, listen to the ref there. He is the authority. You know, if you look at Damian Drexler's mask, it looks like his right eye might be blocked from uh, from his vision. So I don't know if, uh, th does this guy only have one eye, Travis? Or? I, I, I would love to know more about the, the Drexler brothers for sure. Uh, definitely a, a mysterious entity. Oh, wow. right on the back of the neck. The faculty showing off tonight. They're making sure the Drexler brothers Got to get carried out of here. That's right. Michael Osborne wrenching that neck. The head oh, is not supposed to be torqued like that. And it looks like Michael Osborne, uh, you know, we do have high definition cameras. You can kind of see in his face. I guess there was an event yesterday where he got his eye. He, he, he's got a little bit of a black eye there. Wondering if that's going to play a part in this match at all. I think all it did was make him more angry. That's right. Taking out all that frustration out on the Drexler brothers. Big time DDT. He flattened them out there. Damian Drexler needs to make a tag. Another close call there. The faculty, they want to make it to round two. Dragging him over to their corner. Here comes Jacob Edwin. These guys work so well together. They are gelling. There you go. I mean, the Drexel brothers, they're, they're not just going to stand to the side and let this happen. I mean, now the numbers are getting to them. What's, what's the name of Damien's brother? Oh, Damien? Of the Drexel brothers, Acheron. Acheron. Here we go, House of Fire, big clothesline. Sidewalk slam, is it? There it is. Beautiful. Whoa. Michael Osborne doesn't know what else to do, but they use that whistle and it worked. He's gonna have to swallow that whistle from Acheron. There you go, double sunset flip. Oh, but they got the double pin. Double oh. pin. Drexler Brothers advance to the tournament. What a contest. That was a huge win for the Drexler Brothers. Unbelievable. Huge victory for the Drexler Brothers who are now in the semifinals of this tournament to determine the new Tag Team Champion in World Domination Wrestling Alliance. And earlier tonight, we talked to the Dan Sensation, who told us how personal their match will be against the father figures. We were actually able to talk to the father figures about this match. Let's hear what they had to say. Ooh. How you feeling there, Unc? I'm feeling good, I'm feeling good. Unc is here, Unc is feeling good and ready to fight. Unk is good. Dad's good, as you can see. See, I got a few rules for everybody tonight when you get here. I need you to use your inside voices. I need you to not talk when I'm talking, just like everybody is now. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to go out there tonight. We're going to meet up with these dancing Lucha Libre guys. Don't even know what their names are. It doesn't matter because you'll forget about them when we're done with them. See, they're going to come out and want to dance. We're here to fight. We're here to teach him a lesson. I heard Dance Dance doesn't even have a real dad. Well, guess what, Dance Dance? I'll be your daddy. He can be your uncle. That's right. The father figures go one on one against Dan Sensation on the second match of this tournament to determine the new World Domination Wrestling Alliance Tag Champion. Let's go ringside for the action. First of all, young man, that's the last time I hear your outside voice. We're inside. That's my first rule. Be quiet, please. Thank you for watching. 
Experience all the excitement of World Domination Wrestling Alliance Pro Wrestling Live. Come and become part of the show. Showing support to your favorite wrestlers. For more information, call us or look us up on Facebook. There is nothing like experiencing World Domination Wrestling Alliance Live. We'll see you at the next show.
Experience all the excitement of World Domination Wrestling Alliance Pro Wrestling Live. Come and become part of the show, showing support to your favorite wrestlers. For more information, call us or look us up on Facebook. There is nothing like experiencing World Domination Wrestling Alliance live. We'll see you at the next show. Dance Dance Lucha Libre, he was professionally trained to dance in the Bronx, New York. I know that to be true. He uh, used to be a backup choreographer for Jay Lo. Oh, come on, dads. Father figures are not amused. It's going to be hard for me to keep my composure in this match. I mean, the dads, I mean, the father figures, come on, man. They may just put them over their knee and give them a spanking. What do you think? I think so. Oh. Look at that. That was, that was wonderful. Anton Nathan, he had to he had to get in his own drop kick. That was beautiful. It looks like the father figures, they're about to ground everybody in the room. They better not put DAD and Yuri Neil Callahan in bad moods. Like they're gonna put these guys in timeout. For sure. Yeah, good luck trying to put Dan Stance Lucha Libre in timeout. That man doesn't sit still. I mean, I'm not going to lie, though. The father figures, I think that they are living up to their name so far. I think that a lot of people, you know, without that figure in their life, could really use these guys. Know what I mean, Gavin? I know what you mean. I just know that uh, Mr. Yuri Neil Callahan, as he likes to be called, he might be more focused on all these uh, moms out here more than this match. You he's, do have to focus. He needs to get his head in this game. I know uh, Mr. DAD, you know, he's in the game. Here we go with the duck under waist lock. There you go, Dan Stance being a nice guy. Their, their main goal, they want to make it the round two for sure. Double suplex. Nice. Almost knocked him out of his Adidas. Yeah, that dad's going to have a couple back problems after this. Adidas, all day I dream about suplexes. Suplexes, phenomenal. I've never heard that phrase before. What's Anton Nathan got in store? He didn't get all of that, but it's okay. He did not. Because he did make him roll to the other side there. I mean, and whenever a guy like Yuri goes down, he might not get back up. He's got sciatica problems, you know, like most dads. I'm sure I can hear his knees cracking from here. <laughs> oh, we're having fun. 
with the big club to the back. I mean, that's definitely what I would do, uh, is to work on the back of the father figures. I know it's not very safe for him to wear that gold chain in there. Here we go, Dance oh. Dance, getting some little bit of crowd participation. Oh, the crowd is hot here in Martinsburg, West Virginia. Oh, no! That hits the father figures where it hurts the most. I hope they do not want any more children, Travis. And that's what these guys live for. Their whole dedication. He's got that chin lock in there and pretty deep there. Gary Neil Callahan needs to make that tag. If they want to advance in this tag team tournament. He's got him hooked under the head there. Oh, there you go. It looks like the father figure's got the upper hand now. Here comes Dad. I hope the referee checked that fanny pack. Yeah, there could be uh, there could be band-aids. Who knows what's in there? What do most dads carry? I don't know. I don't know. Probably uh, a, ha a harmonica for sure. Probably harmonica. Probably a wallet shaped in his butt. <laughs> uh, probably uh, a handkerchief to blow his nose. Well, he's got chops. That's a big back elbow. He's I got mean, elbows he's, too. He's getting it done for sure. Oh! That elevated you see him that up. Strength. Amazing. Dad with a close two there. Oh, he's choking Dance Dance Lucha Libre. What is this? Uh, there you go. Anton Nathan starting a Let's Go Lucha chant. He likes to be the head of the household and the head of the ring. Oh, come oh. on. You didn't need to do that. You need to wake up, Anton Nathan. Oh, Richie White, senior referee, making sure, the, trying his best to make sure order stays in line. Very good. Low blow there. I'm not sure if you caught that at home. Well, we definitely saw it. I felt it, Travis. Here we go. Beautiful scoop slam. Go. Big leg drop. Atomic, if you will. You're going to have to do a lot more to take down Dan Sands Lucha Libre. Yuri Neil Callahan needs to stop trying to coach referee Richie White and focus on the match. Go taking out Anton again. Lo looks like this is a reoccurring theme. Anton Nathan's only going to take but so much. Come on, Richie, turn around. I would love to see that, that beautiful senton yeah. by uh, Anton Nathan. They, the father figures would be calling in tonight if Anton can get that senton in. Uh-oh, what has he got here? He's going to show us what he has. Now we can finally find out what's in the fanny pack. A sweatband? He's pumping up his shoes. What a nerd. Keeps the sweat out of your eyes, Travis. All right, another close call there. Anton Nathan looking a little frustrated there on the corner. Dan Stan's trying his best to come back now. Big punch to the gut, backing him up in the corner. What's dad got in store? He's got a butt whooping in store for him. He's gonna go get the belt before too long. Back in my day, it was a tree switch. There's a huge list back in my day. Yeah, they'd make us find it ourselves, and I don't wanna go in deeper on all that. That was a great tornado DDT. All I know is the father figures keep beating up on these guys. We're going to have to call CPS. We will. Could this be the 450, Travis? Oh, I hope so. 
He has a beautiful 450 splash. I really hope the fans get a chance to see it tonight. Nobody home. Oh, and look at that. He's got oh. Anton Nathan. No. Anton Nathan eating the post. Oh, it looks like the father figures has the ball in their court now. He's using the gold chain. Did you see that? And he used it. I'm sorry, I totally missed it. I'm out here looking at Anton Nathan. Whoa. Big rotating slam there. Oh, come on, father figures. I thought these guys were gonna be nice guys. And that's a three. I'm glad they're not my dad, Travis. I would love to be adopted. They don't even look like they tell bedtime stories, and that makes me sick. Congratulations to the father figures who now advance to the semifinals of the World Domination Wrestling Alliance Tournament to determine the new Tag Team Champion. Their victory puts them right there on the semifinals. But now let's go to our third match and a team that has been given a lot to talk about lately ever since they came to Berkeley Mania. I'm talking about the Nanny Dead Squad. A team that has proven to be tough. A team that has proven to be lethal. And on this tournament they're facing the Lucha Amigos. Introducing first the team of Mr. Motivation A. Velasquez and El Lucha King Felipe Jr. Los Lucha Amigos! Los Lucha Amigos, here we go. Crowd definitely behind these guys. With the combination of Mr. Motivation and the Lucha King, we should see a real force to be reckoned with. We will find out for sure. I don't think the WDWA audience has even uh, got to experience how good these guys really are. They've been getting the shorter end of the stick a lot around here. And I think tonight, on your way to a uh, to chance to be the tag team champions, I mean, I would love to see these guys show their abilities here tonight, Travis. Oh, I couldn't agree more. Let's shine a light on Lucha Amigos. Giving the fans what they paid to see. That's right. And their opponents, they are the team of No Mercy, Zeke Mercer and Scarlett, the Nani Pet Squad. Here we go. This is the second time we have seen the Nani Death Squad. And I'm telling you, they were phenomenal the first time we saw them. They were tremendous going over at Berkeley Mania. Scarlet is scary, Trash. I'm glad we're sitting way over here. I wouldn't want to find myself caught in an elevator with Scarlet for sure. After they won their match at Berkeley Mania, Scarlet said she promises to bring pain to WDWA. Don't sleep on, on Zeke Mercer, man. I've seen this guy before, he is great. Yeah, very talented individual for sure. I think uh, Zeke Mercer is gonna match really well against these guys. You should definitely see a fast paced uh, style here. But then again, whenever Scarlett gets in there, she slows down the pace and she dominates. They uh, took out the Radical Stars at Berkeley Mania. That's why the Radical Stars will not be in this tag tournament. It's true, they're still feeling the effects. We yeah. will not be seeing them in the next couple episodes of WDWA. Yeah, Scarlett uh, took them out with a pop-up powerbomb. That's right. All right, now we got Felipe starting off with Zeke Mercer. Tight lock up there. Can't get him off his feet. All right, let's see what happens here. He's got that headlock in there tight. Yeah, Felipe Jr. a little bit too quick for Zeke Mercer. 
look at that going. Hey, that's smart. Go for a pin. That's the way to win a match. Yeah. All it takes is that one, two, three. Well, Zeke Mercer, he's looking a little desperate trying to get out of this headlock here. Whips them all. Shoulder tackle. Here we go, some lucha action. Oh, beautiful hurricanrana from Zeke Mercer. Oh, oh. Oh, wow. That was impressive. He... Zeke Mercer knows exactly what he's doing. Yeah. That was like a spinning chop. Speaking oh, of chops. I felt that. We go using the ropes to his advantage now. Oh. Very impressive. Wow, Circus Olay right there. That was amazing. Yeah, these guys motivating each other. Look at that hop off the back with a big line in the corner, nowhere to go. Eddie Velasquez saying they ain't done. Here comes Felipe Jr. Gonna hit a second one on him. Oh. Whoa! There you go. Spicy move right there. That was hot. Yeah, Eddie Velasquez getting the crowd pumped up. Here comes Zeke Mercer, though. Oh my gosh. Here comes Scarlett. This is what the fans have been waiting for. This is not what the Lucha Amigos have been waiting for. No. What do you have, Eddie Velasquez? Because Scarlett is ready. Eddie Velasquez wants to take Scarlett out on the dinner for some tacos. Trash oh. taco. Whoa. Whoa. He's gonna have to be eating his tacos through a straw. I think she was tired of him talking. Maybe she doesn't like tacos. <laughs> With the big whip, what do we got here? Spine oh. Buster. Shades of Ron Simmons right there. I was very impressed by Scarlett from Berkeley Mania, and I was really looking forward to watching her tonight. I think uh, they have a huge chance of winning this tag team tournament, Travis. Oh, I, I'm definitely, they're a favorite in my mind so far, for sure. Scarlet is just, she exudes power. She is not intimidated at all. Bringing Eddie Velasquez to his knees. What has she got in store there? Some knees to the gut there. Scarlet and Zeke Mercer work very well with each other. They are called the Nanny Death Squad for a reason. Here we go. What do we got here? Oh! Big time clothesline. Yeah, she's getting sick of the fans, man. She's not wrestling for the fans. She's wrestling for herself, for sure. Oh! Hey. Bringing some forearms to Scarlett. Whoa! I'm Have a you. seat, Eddie Velasquez. Yeah, she's powerful. Whoa. It's the biggest leg drop we've seen tonight. Velasquez is gonna have to tag out. I would if I was Eddie. I'd get Felipe Jr. in there as soon as possible. Uh, Felipe Jr. does not look like he wants to get in there. Or maybe he does. That was close. He almost got the tag. I don't know. He, seems like Eddie Velasquez needs some motivation, Travis. Those forearms look like they're doing nothing to her. Oh! Whoa. Samoan drop almost through the middle of the ring. And he tried to get out of it, and she just... Wow. She just ate those forearms like they were nothing. 
man. The match is in the corner of Scarlett and Zeke right now. I think there is zero chance they'll be going out for tacos after this. I mean, Eddie's trying his best. Big European uppercut there. The nanny death squad could wow. be your next WDWA tag team champions. But Eddie Velasquez comes off with the clothesline, taking Scarlett straight down. Straight out of nowhere. And the height of that, wow, Eddie Velasquez, he's, he's got some hops. Now let's see who makes it to their corner first. Felipe Jr.'s ready, Zeke Mercer's ready. Oh, and he gets attacked. So is Scarlett. House of Fire. Oh. Oh, he caught him. Oh, he caught, caught him again. again. There you go. Oh, Zeke Mercer, big elbow on the lower back. Oh. Ooh, look at Felipe Jr. There you go. Beautiful spin kick. Shades of Owen Hart there. I love seeing that. Two and a three. No. It could go in either way this time. Eddie Velasquez. Looks like he's trying to communicate with Felipe. They cannot be wasting time. I mean, whenever you got a chance to pull the trigger, you got to pull it. Well, I understand all about motivating your partners, but you cannot waste time against these guys. Look that. Heck of a tag move there. Now here comes Scarlett. She does not want to see Zeke go down like that. Come on, Billy, get Scarlett out of there. There you go. Scarlett said, I'm taking the bull by the horns. Eddie Velasquez doing his best. Locked it. Oh, the backhand. What is she going for here? That just knocked Eddie Velasquez loopy. He is seeing stars right now. She's grabbing him by the throat. There you go. Oh, whoa. That had to have done it. That had to have done it. Nanny, death squad with the win. That's all she wrote. Yeah, I'm not sure if uh, Scarlett was the, the legal participant there for the pin. I think Billy Bowers may have lost control. The Lucha Amigos are always exciting to watch perform, but tonight it wasn't enough. And it's the Nanny Dead Squad that advances to the semifinal of this tournament. But now let's go to our last match of the first round because on the way to the ring is Big Money Inc. These two guys are not messing around and they have promised to walk away with the tag team gold around their waist. Big Money Inc. is taking on the regulators and that match comes right after this break. Experience all the excitement of World Domination Wrestling Alliance Pro Wrestling Live. Come and become part of the show, showing support to your favorite wrestlers. For more information, call us or look us up on Facebook. There is nothing like experiencing World Domination Wrestling Alliance Live. We'll see you at the next show.
experience all the excitement of World Domination Wrestling Alliance Pro Wrestling Live. Come and become part of the show, showing support to your favorite wrestlers. For more information, call us or look us up on Facebook. There is nothing like experiencing World Domination Wrestling Alliance live. We'll see you at the next show. In their opponents from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. They have the team of Officer Robert Wright and Detective David Hetfield. like to call these guys Shane Malice's goons. But they are forced to be reckoned with, Travis. Impressive tag team, these guys. Long time. They've been tag teaming over half a decade. They know the ring like the back of their hand. This is going to be a hard ending contest right here. If either one of these teams become WDWA World Tag Team Champions, I have a feeling they will hold it for a very long time. Yeah, there is not one tag team in this entire tournament that I've been able to truthfully say couldn't make it all the way to the end. And that's what you get here at the World Domination Wrestling Alliance. So, so far, just to recap for this tournament, Travis, we have the Drexler brothers. Yes. They're still in this tournament. We have the father figures. They're still in this tournament. We just saw the Nanny Death Squad go over on Lucha Amigos, and the fourth team will be whoever wins this contest right here. Yes, the final deciding tag team right here, making it to round two. It's been a great tournament, once in a lifetime tournament to crown tag champions. That's right. Couldn't be more proud than me calling it right here with you, Gavin Jackson. I agree, Travis. Always a pleasure being with, being ringside with you. Absolutely. So the way WDWA is gonna work things, the winner of match one will go against the winner of match three. Okay. And winner of match two will face off of whoever wins this. Hey, that's okay. Everybody at home, uh, you, I mean, I'm sure you're just enjoying the, the action in the ring. We just love bringing it to you here on TV10. There you go, Robert Wright. All Stand your ground. Excellent. Can't wait for that. Can't wait to Robert Wright stood his ground right there, flipped him inside out. Oh. Big headbutt from Robert Wright. Here comes the, de de the detective, Davey Hetfield. Keep your eyes on the regulators, man. They're going places. Wow, Aubrey Wright in no sense is a small person. I'll tell you who's going places, Aubrey Wright right there. He yeah. went flying through the sky. Speaking of guys close to the sky, Travis, big yeah. Ivan Ali. Oh, you said it, here he is in all his glory. David Heffel is not intimidated. Davey likes a good challenge. He wants these people to get their tickets worth and this is it right here. You know, Robert Wright and David Heffel, both of these guys are actively on the force. I'm sure they gotta deal with, with big men of all sizes. It's true, uh, I hear that they work out of Cambria County. They've been long, long time in the force. Look at that, Davey Hetfield, I mean, he's, he's throwing those punches with everything he has, and Lance Ivan, nothing. You know, I have never seen David Hetfield be so nervous before. Never. But he cannot touch Ivan Ali. Look at Lance go. Oh! There you go. Wow. Oh. How is he going to put his badge on after that, Travis? Yes, you heard that at home, everybody. Here we go with the big whip. 
Here comes Aubrey Wright. Oh, nice forearm. He whips him back over to Ivan. Big boot to the chest. There you go. With the pin, one, two. What a great team. Big Money Inc., they came to get some, some big titles to take home with them. Well, Big Money Inc. loves their gold. Needed the back from Robert Wright. There you go. I mean, he's seen enough. Davy Hetfield taking advantage of the situation. Big Robert Wright. Whoa, oh. big splash. There you go. It's going to be hard to get up after that splash. One of the biggest bicycle knees I've ever seen from David Hetfield just now. Robert Wright's got Aubrey Wright right, right where he wants him. Right, right, right. Right. There you go. Big double axe handle. Whoa. Detective David. Headfield saying he's smarter than everybody here. Just called everybody in here idiots. What's his problem? Yeah, I'm all up. Uh, I'm all about respecting those with the bat with a badge, but it's gonna be hard to show these guys any respect. Yeah, I'm I'm all about respecting your elders. There's a lot of old people in the room. All right, now he ducked it. There you go, a flying knee of his own. Here comes Lance Ivan. Are the stars gonna align for this move here? Yes, it is. Look at that, put him on the on the top turnbuckle there. Oh, what is this? No. He's not doing what he what I think he is. Look at the strength of Ivan Ali. Oh, Look at that. Robert Wright takes him out. Holy Toledo. Unbelievable. Oh. Picks him up in a Samoan drop. No, is this gonna be their finishing tag maneuver? They, they went for it. Ivan Ali was not letting that happen. There you go. That's going to take David Hetfield out. He just ate the ring post. That's going to take him out, I think. You think that's going to take him out? Oh, for sure. And now Robert Wright. No, watch out. He's got a weapon. He, and he gave, it, he gave it to Robert Wright. Oh, come on, ref. Robert didn't hit him. I'm sorry, Travis. I was looking at my notes. I missed what just happened. Oh, I, well, it's a little too late now. Robert Wright, it looked like he was throwing the foreign object. He never used it. Are you serious, Richie? You know, I, took, I took my eyes off for the action real quick, and I totally missed it. I, I apologize, everybody at home. I would have never let that go. As being the commissioner here at WDWA, I am the law and order. And uh, I, I don't like seeing things like that happen in that ring, Travis. At the end of the day, I'm glad that you give the final say to the referee. And just like that, the semifinals for this tournament are set. Big Money Inc. who just defeated the Regulators at Benz and they will be taking on the father figures who earlier tonight defeated Dan Sensation on a very close match. And on the other semi-final, Nanny Dead Squad, who made easy work of the Lucha Amigos, will be facing the Drexler Brothers. These two matches will be taking place tonight, but right now let's go to our next match, and for this we're gonna travel back in time a couple years ago, Berkeley Mania. Just last month, Kevin Mears made the impossible and became world domination Racing alliance heavyweight champion this man is not a quitter and for many years he's been fighting to be on top of the ranks in wdwa tonight we go back and relieve a match against cisco a hardcore match for the west virginia championship
Experience all the excitement of World Domination Wrestling Alliance Pro Wrestling Live. Come and become part of the show. Showing support to your favorite wrestlers. For more information, call us or look us up on Facebook. There is nothing like experiencing World Domination Wrestling Alliance live. We'll see you at the next show.
experience all the excitement of World Domination Wrestling Alliance Pro Wrestling Live. Come and become part of the show, showing support to your favorite wrestlers. For more information, call us or look us up on Facebook. There is nothing like experiencing World Domination Wrestling Alliance live. We'll see you at the next show. Hello again, you are watching World Domination Wrestling Alliance Pro Wrestling. On this episode, we have a special tournament to determine the new WDWA Tag Team Champions. Earlier tonight, we saw already the first round of this tournament, who saw the Drexler Brothers, the Father Figures, Nanny Death Squad, and Big Money Inc. advancing to the semifinals. And right now, let's go ringside for the first leg of the semifinals for this tournament. Nanny Death Squad will be taking on the Dressler Brothers. They eliminated the faculty to uh, have this opportunity against the Nanny Death Squad. Billy Bowers is your officiate for this contest and we are underway. All right, Zeke Mercer, what do you got? With the big tie up here. Got him in the waist lock. Can he get out of it? Yes, he can. Here on with the reversal. Zeke Mercer's having a little bit of trouble. Doesn't think I, I don't think he can get out of this. Uh, he knew, he knew that the ref had to break it up. Back him into the corner. Zeke with a smart veteran-like move right there. Another tie up here. There you go, got him in a tight headlock. Akaran just a little bit taller, a little bit stronger than Zeke. Taking the advantage, tags in Damien. Drexel Brothers with a little bit of tag team action. Double, Double attack. Yeah. Here we go. There we go. Big, picking up Zeke for the big scoop slam. Oh. He's going to have to see a chiropractor after that one. There's a very vocal fan in the crowd. Fans yelling at Damien to hook the leg. Now what's Damien got in store for Zeke? Manhandling Zeke at this point. They all oh. want to see the Drexler brothers win, you know, so the fans want, want to see them do everything it takes for the win. And if, uh, if hooking the leg gets you the win, you need to hook the leg. For sure. Uh, Scarlett 
Scarlett thought she might have to get in the ring for that one. She is waiting in anticipation. Don't forget, ladies and gentlemen, this all leads to a WDWA Tag Team Championship match. One of these teams will be in the finals. That's right. And they will be facing either the Big Money Incorporated or the father figures. It's the big race for the goal here. What's Zeke got for him? Oh. Here comes Scarlett. Not that Scarlett cares or not, but the fans love her here in Martinsburg, West Virginia. I mean, I don't think they've ever seen somebody like Scarlett. Nobody has. I've never seen nobody like Scarlett. She scares me. Ooh, with the pie face. With the Drexler brothers being from an asylum, they shouldn't be so scared of her. He went for it. Scarlett was ready, though. I'm sorry, Travis. I was a little distracted. This beautiful lady with a Gavin Jackson shirt just walked by me, and my eyes kind of went that way. Oh, come on, Gavin. You got to stay. Sorry, keep, sorry. I'm watching keep your now. The game, I'm watching man. now. I'm watching now. What a beautiful move. Scarlett looks like she's got the upper hand right now. Ooh, that's a big punch. Big forearm. Forearm, yes. Here we go with the big whip. She's going to turn his head all the way around with that. Showing her power. Oh, I think the ring moved a little bit, Travis. That'll do it every single time. Shaking the foundation. Scarlett knows the hook the leg. She did. Dodging all the hits. Oh, straight to the throat. That's how you take care of business. Scarlett going for the cover now. This gets clothesline taking Damian Drexler right off his feet. Scarlett's got, what, is, what does she have him in here? Pain. She always has pain. Using her body to her, to her advantage here. And she's showing the crowd what she can do. If the Drexler brothers don't come out with a win tonight, it's going to be hard going back to that asylum, staring all the fans in the face. Here comes Zeke Mercer. Oh. Big shot to the gut there. I heard that. Come on, Zeke. Another shot like that. Damon Drexler might be puking up what he ate for lunch. Oh, come on. Behind the ref's back. Looks like the nanny death squad is taking advantage of the situation. There you go. Going for the cover here. Just a two. Way to cut off the ring, Zeke Mercer. Zeke Mercer is not playing tonight. Tag team wrestling is a, a lot different than singles wrestling. And uh, not only do you have to use your partner and uh, you have to cut off the ring, it's very uh, it's very methodical. It's really the best words I can use. Yeah. Oh, I love tag wrestling. As soon as the WDWA announced that we had a tag team tournament, I'm all in. And whenever you got tag teams like the Nanny Death Squad, Drexler Brothers, Big Money Inc., Father Figures. Oh, it's been an amazing tournament. Looks like one half of the Drexler Brothers back, trying to get back up onto his feet now. What's he got in store? Beautiful leg lariat. I agree. Oh, I'd love to see it. He got all of it, too. I'm very impressed with Zeke Mercer. I'd like to see a lot more of this kid. 
What a talented young man. He's got a bright future in this business. Yes, he does, Travis. Here comes Scarlett. What is oh oh what is this from Scarlett? Oh my gosh. That'll do it. Damian Drexler needs to get a tag and a tag fast. Oh. That swing and neck breaker. That could have been it. That could be it. I'm thinking that's it. Not just yet. Damian Drexler gets his shoulder up. But they're still in this. Scarlet hooking the arm here. What? Here we go. European uppercut. Nobody oh. home. Turn the tide, boys. There you go. Big splash in the corner. This could be a suplex. Whoa! Big suplex by Damian Drexler. He needs to make the tag, Travis. He has to at this point. He used what was left in the tank for that suplex there, and now it's anybody's game. Zeke Mercer's waiting. We could be we could be seeing a huge house of fire here in a second. Billy Batters counting up to five now. Six. Both these teams need to make a tag. Oh, Zeke Mercer got the tag. Here we go. Oh, Whoa. turned him inside out with that one. And another one. Zeke Mercer in a bad way. Beautiful sidewalk slam. Oh! oh that was a close one. Did you see how one. fast Scarlett got over there? She's got speed, too. She's got it all. She does. You know, she promised to bring pain here to WDWA. She's fast. She's strong. Maybe she's born with it. Got him in the corner now. Here we go. That's a whole lot of woman coming at you. That is. Here comes a whole lot of man, Zeke Mercer. Oh! Oh, he jammed up that knee. She's going for her finishing oh. maneuver. No, that, that was her finisher. She's not the legal man. Billy said it. Good job, Billy. Good. Good job, Billy. There nice call. And we have the Nanny Death Squad going to the finals. Wow, what a match. Yet another impressive showing from the Nanny Death Squad. Very hard fought match, but Nanny Death Squad has officially become the first to qualify for the Tag Team Championship final that will be taking place right here in a couple of weeks. But right now, let's go to the other leg of the semi final where Big Money Inc. will be taking on the father figure. I don't know why you guys are cheering for these two. Everybody talked about us cheating with the chain. He didn't see anything. Of course, that's why he raised our hands. But you watch these two set two other guys up with the chain. Guess what? That kind of irritates me. So with that being said, Gavin Jackson, can I get you to the ring? I got a question for you. He's got a question for me? He's got a question for you, Gavin. All right, let me go see what he has to say. Go for it. Wow, Gavin Jackson being called to the ring by one half of the one half of the father figures. Yeah, uh, being a gentleman to Gavin Jackson, that's real nice. Hey Gavin, we got a question for you. You already know the answer. Oh, you got a team too. How fresh that is. Not really. Can't do it. Can't look like Yuri. Here's my question for you. Everybody wants to complain about us using the chain illegally. Obviously, these guys did. We didn't. Didn't happen. So here's my question for you. And it's either yes or I'm going to send you to your room. You understand?
know, man, like, uh, I'm not good at taking orders. Whether it be for Pops or anybody else, man. So don't be giving me the orders. Tornado? You want a tornado against these guys? Right? Experience all the excitement of World Domination Wrestling Alliance Pro Wrestling Live. Come and become part of the show. Showing support to your favorite wrestlers. For more information, call us or look us up on Facebook. There is nothing like experiencing World Domination Wrestling Alliance Live. We'll see you at the next show.
Experience all the excitement of World Domination Wrestling Alliance Pro Wrestling Live. Come and become part of the show. Showing support to your favorite wrestlers. For more information, call us or look us up on Facebook. There is nothing like experiencing World Domination Wrestling Alliance live. We'll see you at the next show. It's official. The commissioner has spoken. It is now a tornado tag match. Rules being, there are no, you don't need to tag your partner now. Both teams, both men legal, all four men. I don't think I, I'm sorry to cut you off, Travis. Okay. I really am. I don't think these guys even understand what they just asked for. Here we go. Now it's underway. He's got Dad back in the ring now. Oh, look how the tables have turned. Wow. With that big boot colliding into the face of Dad. I just, I feel so weird. His name's Dad. It I gotta Dad. keep calling him Dad. I know. It's like it's one big sick joke when the whole world's calling him their daddy. <laughs> Alright, he's got Yuri now, look at that, smart move. Yeah, Dad needs to be very careful trying to send me to my room. Yeah, that was a bad move on their part. Yeah, I'll break Dad's head. Big double suplex on Lance Ivan. Aubrey needs to get back in this match. Aubrey Wright looking like he's trying to put the pieces back together. Lance Ivan's in the corner there and in, in disarray. We go with the big double whip. Nope. Whoa! Look at that. Impressive. That was a beautiful uh, reversal right there. I've never seen that before, Travis. Ooh, a big fall like that. Lance Ivan. You took Lance uh, You took uh, taking uh, Ivan Ali out. Big Samoan drop. That could have changed everything. The action spilling on the outside out here. Wow. What has Ivan Ali got in, in store for Dad? I think Dad's about to get a butt whooping of his own. Yes, he is. They're calling for something big here. Dad needs to watch his mouth or else I'll lace my boots back up. Got him up. Whoa. Shook the very foundation. Double suplex. Amazing. One of these teams is going to go to the end, possibly winning the tag team championships. Father figures asked for this Texas Tornado style death match, tag match, but uh, they better be careful what they're asking for. Yeah, they might they might be regretting that decision right now. Wait a minute, Ivan Ali, he he's got the chain. He has that chain. Richie's being distracted, and he used it. You know they they get what they asked for, Travis. That's right. Whoa! Ouch. There you go. That's a chop. Wow, uh, way to cut the big man down. Whoa! That'll wow. do it. Man, Ivan Ali. That was a Impressive. beautiful back elbow. Oh, Aubrey told him to finish him. And that's what he's gonna do. Whoa. That's it. Count it, ref. Father figures are out of the tournament.
Congratulations to Big Money Inc who just qualified for the final of this tournament and they will be facing Nani Death Squad in a couple weeks right here in World Domination Wrestling Alliance Pro Wrestling. But right now I want to invite you to join us next week as we're going to have a special Night of Champions episode. Wildman Robbie Page will be defending the WDWA Light Heavyweight Championship on a triple threat, a match you cannot miss. Also next week we'll be having a battle royal to determine the new World Domination Wrestling Alliance Television Champion. And of course, after his huge victory at Berkeley Mania, Triple Fears, Kevin Mears became the World Domination Wrestling Alliance Heavyweight Champion. And next week, he will be awarded the brand new championship title. All of this and more next week right here in World Domination Wrestling Alliance for all wrestling. Until then, thank you so much for watching. Have a good night.